I wanted to share something about this community. Uh, I was born in Israel and uh, grew up uh, in a kibbutz, in a, in a community over in Israel. And I wanted just to share an experience that I had over the last year and a half that I wanted to share, you know, uh, with some other people. About a year and a half ago, I was, I was diagnosed with cancer in an immediate, unexpected way. And within three days, I, I found myself in the hospital. I went through three operations in one week. I was in the hospital for 16 days. 10 days in ICU and and then when I came when I came back home I was I started an in intensive a chemotherapy treatment for six months and I wanted to share of some of the some of the experiences that I had during the time a I was gone from work for eight and a half months. And during the whole time, uh, the community kept paying my, my salary. Uh, all of my medical bills have been taken care of and are still being taken care of by this community. The love and the care that my family experienced were were simply overwhelming. There were people that went shopping for my family for months, grocery shopping, adult shopping, faithfully, month after month after month, while my wife you know, was staying at home taking care of me. Quite a few of them refused to get paid back when they bought us the thing that we needed. Uh, there were, people came to fix our house, mow the lawn, uh, took my girls to town when they had a need to buy something, uh, bought us, the week I came back from the hospital, we got you know, meals for the whole week and uh, while I was in the hospital, my, uh, my brother-in-law family took my whole family of seven children over to their house over for dinner every day for, I believe, for about two weeks. Uh, I thought about the scripture that says, a brother is born for time of adversity. And that's what I experienced here in this place. When I was in the hospital, I remember the multitudes of visits and cards and love and care that were showered upon me. And I especially remember a few cards that I got from, from Blair and Regina Adams that really touched, touched my heart. When, when, I, when I was dismissed from the hospital, I was supposed to go to a rehab for an extended period of time. And our community doctor came over to my house for a period of few months. They set up a hospital bed in my bedroom and he came to take care of me twice a day for two or three months, I believe. And the love and the care of this, of this community was overwhelming. And as I said, I always knew it was a wonderful place. I just know it 10 times more now 
that it's the best place that I found for me and for my family, and I love everybody here dearly, and I'm, I'm very thankful for what God has done for me through this community, and I hope that I'll be able to pay back one of these days a little bit of what's been given to us.